Here we have the Wine in the Sun cocktail, inspired by Tim Minchin's great Christmas carol for our times. I'm going to take 45 mils of our strawberry eucalyptus gin and just place it in a large glass here. I've got a stainless wine glass, use whatever wine glass you've got at home. Next up is 60 mils of clarified apple juice. Depending on the season, I, I like to use Pink Lady, but it is dependent uh, on sweetness and also acidity. Got some strongly brewed jasmine and elderflower tea. And then just depending on how sharp uh, that apple juice happens to be, I can adjust and regulate with a tiny touch of acidity and a tiny touch of sweetness. Those things are really kind of dependent on taste, but as a rough uh, guide to proportions, we want three parts of gin, four parts of apple, two of tea, one of sour, and one of our sugar syrup. Add ice directly to the, the glass. Nice and generous to keep the drink cold. And then I'll finish it with some strawberries, which I've just poached in a little bit of elderflower and elderberry syrup. Just makes a delicious little snack whilst one is consuming the drink. Three for good measure. And there we have it, one of our most popular cocktails, the wine in the sun.